Nature does not mess around. When we think we've seen it all, it shows up with something that makes us question our own eyes. Animals so bizarre, so remarkable, that they seem to have come out of a mythology book or straight from another planet. These here are ones you've probably never heard of. Some you won't believe are real. Today, we're going to meet seven creatures that seem to have supernatural superpowers. But they are real, very real. Animal number one, the mantis shrimp. Despite the name, the mantis shrimp is not a shrimp. It belongs to the order Stomatopoda, a group of crustaceans with over 400 species. It's like a distant relative of crabs and lobsters with an explosive temperament. Its superpower? An unbelievably fast punch capable of breaking glass aquariums. It uses specialized appendages called raptorial claws, which function like tensioned springs. When it strikes, it reaches speeds of 80 kilometers per hour in less than three milliseconds, faster than a 22 caliber bullet. The impact is so violent that it creates a vapor bubble, a phenomenon called cavitation. When this bubble collapses, it emits heat, sound, and even light. And if that's not incredible enough, it also has one of the most complex visual systems on the planet. While humans see three color channels, red, green, and blue, the mantis shrimp sees up to 12. Can you imagine how this hyper-reality world of colors would look to us? Furthermore, it sees ultraviolet light, a type of radiation invisible to us with a wavelength shorter than violet, and polarized light, which is the vibration of light in a single plane useful for detecting hidden prey. It sees the world in hyperreality, an alien ninja with cosmic vision and explosive strength. If you enjoy topics related to nature and science, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to our channel. It helps us a lot to keep bringing these beautiful facts, and we're sure you'll love the fascinating content we'll present here. Animal number two, the panther chameleon. Native to Madagascar, the panther chameleon is one of the most colorful species in the world. Besides changing color, which we'll understand better, it has an elastic tongue that can extend up to twice its body length to capture prey with surgical precision. If this rule were applied to your body, for example, one meter and 60 centimeters tall, your tongue could reach a length of three meters and 20 centimeters. The color change happens because of cells called iridophores, which contain nanoscale crystals that reflect light. By altering the distance between the crystals, the chameleon changes the reflected color like a magical solar panel. But this ability goes far beyond camouflage. When two males face off, they turn vibrantly colorful to intimidate each other. A female who is not interested in mating may dramatically darken her skin as a response. And to complete the show, the panther chameleon does a curious body sway, moving forward and backward as if mimicking a leaf in the wind, confusing both predators and prey at the same time. It's like a performance artist, a mystical warrior, and a tongue cannon all in one, a true illusionist magician of nature. Animal number three, the mimic octopus. The Thaumoctopus mimicus, or mimic octopus, lives in the reefs and estuaries of Southeast Asia. Like all octopuses, it is a highly intelligent cephalopod, capable of problem solving, remembering patterns, and even learning by observation. But this one goes beyond. 
it can imitate with precision up to 15 different animals, such as sea snakes, flounders, eels, and venomous jellyfish. It not only changes color and texture, but it also moves like these animals, copying their gestures and swimming patterns. It's like an actor with a wardrobe full of sea monster costumes. And the most fascinating part, it chooses its costume depending on the predator. If the enemy is afraid of snakes, it becomes a snake. If it fears flounders, it turns into one. An animal with tactical metamorphosis and theatrical intelligence. Animal number four, the Vampira Tuthis infernalis, or the vampire squid from hell. Yes, it sounds like the name of a fantasy movie creature, but it's real, and it's not a true squid or an octopus. It belongs to a unique group of cephalopods that share characteristics of both, a family called Vampyromorphida. This creature lives up to a thousand meters deep, where there's almost no oxygen. Incredibly, it can survive in environments with less than 5% saturation, something lethal for most animals. Its eyes are proportionally the largest in the animal kingdom when compared to the size of its body. And it hasn't changed much since the time of the dinosaurs, over 150 million years ago. Despite the dramatic name, it's not an active predator or dangerous. It feeds on marine snow, small organic debris that slowly falls in the deep ocean. In addition to these superpowers, when threatened, it releases a cloud of bioluminescent mucus that glows for several seconds and confuses predators. A creature with extreme survival, luminous defense, and an ancient design. Animal number five, the bombardier beetle. Belonging to the genus Brachinus, this tiny beetle has one of the most violent defenses in nature. It stores two chemical compounds, hydroquinone and hydrogen peroxide, in separate compartments. When threatened, it mixes the two in a reaction chamber, where enzymes catalyze the formation of an exothermic explosion, releasing a jet of boiling liquid and gas with loud pops. This reaction reaches temperatures of up to 100 degrees Celsius, ejected in directional bursts with high precision, up to 20 times per second, all in a body just a few millimeters long. A tiny creature with bodily alchemy and portable thermal artillery. Animal number six, the Glaucus atlanticus, or blue dragon. The Glaucus atlanticus is a sea slug that looks like a miniature alien dragon. It floats belly up on the ocean surface, using an air pocket to drift with the currents. Despite its size, about three centimeters, it's a voracious predator of dangerous organisms, such as the Portuguese man o' war. The craziest thing? It stores the nematocysts, the stinging cells of the man o' war, in its own body, concentrating the venom to use against enemies. They are hermaphrodites, which means each individual possesses both male and female reproductive organs, increasing the chances of reproduction in vast and scarce environments. A small dragon, but deadly. A venom-stealing strategist with flexible reproduction. Animal number seven, the Turritopsis dorni, or the immortal jellyfish. The Turritopsis dorni, a tiny jellyfish just four to five millimeters in diameter, found in temperate and tropical oceans around the world, is known for an extraordinary feat in nature. It can completely reverse its life cycle, defying aging as we know it. 
Instead of following the irreversible path of aging and death, this species has the ability to perform a process called cellular transdifferentiation, a transformation where adult cells turn into other types of cells, similar to stem cells. This allows it to revert from its adult stage, the medusa, back to the polyp form. This regression can be triggered by environmental stress, injury, lack of food, or aging. Instead of dying, the jellyfish literally rejuvenates, restarting its life in a potentially infinite cycle. For this reason, it's called biologically immortal, though it can still die from external causes, like predation or disease. This ability could potentially contribute to research on human aging, regenerative medicine, and cell therapy. Despite its tiny size and fragile appearance, the Turritopsis dorni carries a deep mystery, a symbol of life's resilience and the power of cellular renewal. Earth is a cauldron of living alchemies. Camouflage, regeneration, underwater explosions, poison control, and even the denial of death. These animals remind us that the natural world is much more magical than it seems, and that true superpowers aren't just in comic books, but swimming, crawling, and flying around. If you enjoyed this journey between the real and the unbelievable, like the video, share, and subscribe. We still have many beautiful creatures to discover. See you next time.